We're here with Chris Armstrong. He is vice president of product at Cavnu. Chris, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. Now, you're working on improving digital infrastructure. Why do you think that's key to the future of our roadways? Well, I, I think we're going through a major change in transportation. We have been building roadways uh, for a long time in the United States, and we're very used to them being these big physical assets that we have to manage, the pavement, the traffic signals, the highways, the bridges. Um, but now we have the technology tools in our hands to turn those into digital assets where we really understand their condition at all times. And digital infrastructure is really the key and the core to bringing that to life. What will these roads look like? Our hope is that we gain full awareness of what's happening on the road at all times. So with a series of technology capabilities and integrated sensors, we can see everything that's happening on the road and we can warn people as soon as it happens. So whether that's a crash or a collision or something as simple as an air mattress falling off the side of the road, an animal being hit on the side of the road, those are things that we can detect very quickly and warn people about immediately. What specific projects are you all working on right now? At Cavenu, we're fortunate to have two wonderful partnerships. One is in the state of Michigan. The other is in the state of Texas, where we're bringing this technology to life and really understanding what's happening on these roadways where we're deploying uh, in real time at all times. What type of technology is being used? So at Cavenu, we've built what we refer to as a next generation road instrumentation system. Uh, it is a continuous field of view coverage, camera and sensor capability where we can see every inch of the highway, all the lanes at all times, and we can not only understand what happens right away, but we can more importantly detect emerging safety risks that happen over time as well. How long do you think it will be to get this technology more widely spread across the country? My hope is, you know, in transport tech transportation technology, we can move really fast, uh, but we also have to be thoughtful in transportation about making changes and bringing new capabilities to the roadway. So I really hope we see this come to life in the next three to five years and people have the experience of always knowing what's happening on the road ahead. Chris, a lot of great insight. It has been a pleasure. Thank you.